We are Lindsay plus Mike, and we are spending the summer living in a renovated RV while traveling across the United States. Our week in Glacier National Park is coming to a close and we're spending our last day exploring the trails before heading to our next destination of Great Falls, Montana, where a surprise is waiting for us. We also got a little surprise in the back of the truck there. If you're enjoying our travels, please remember to like the video, subscribe if you haven't already, and click the bell to get notified when we post a new video each week. Good morning world. Yesterday was quite an eventful day with quite a hair raising drive. I can't say that I had a good night's sleep and have recovered necessarily. But today is a new day. We're gonna try and get a little hiking in and exploring and show Mike a little bit more of Glacier National Park before we have to leave tomorrow. So it rained quite a bit this morning, a little bit in the night, and we're expecting probably to get a little bit wet, but we're doing our best to plan accordingly. Check out all our rain gear here, all our wet weather stuff. This time we're going to stay on the west side of the mountains and not go up into any of the scary passes or anything that will make me nervous. So uh, I think today is going to be a much better day even though it's a little wet. And of course we will probably have some more ice cream. So let's go guys! Our first stop for today is the Apgar Visitor Center. We've got a junior ranger in the making and she needs to go turn in her workbook and get sworn in and get her junior ranger badge. So after this, we're actually gonna go and find a little trailhead. But first, Felicity. I'm going to get my junior ranger badge. And with that, Felicity is a junior ranger of Glacier National Park. That makes six different parks that she's a junior ranger of. <laughs> so now let's go for a little hike. Our first stop of the day, little pull off on the side of the road. This is definitely one of the most gorgeous places we've been to on this, this whole entire trip of ours. Glacier National Park, the water is just crystal clear blue. The mountains are towering and majestic. The trees are just so lush and green. This place is like nourishment for the soul in a way that many of the other places we've been to hasn't been. The ironic part is it's also just terrifying, at least for Lindsay, it's terrifying because of the mountains. They're, you know, they're nice when they're over in the distance, uh, but when we have to drive up them, that's when things get a little dicey. I like the mountains from the <laughs> bottom. I don't like being on top of them, but I really, really do love them from down here. <laughs> it's an interesting kind of juxtaposition here where she loves it here. She absolutely loves this park, but we can't drive through it. This is the road that goes through it, goes over the mountains. It's interesting to see, to see how this massive amount of flowing water has just kind of caused these curves and circles and kind of bowls in the, in the rock. And you can see it like right there, it's like swirling, just biting away over time at the rock. We're at Red Rock now. Destination two of the day. Let's go check that out.
So this park has these interesting little shuttle, I don't even know what they're, shuttle buses, shuttle limos, that they'll take people on tours in. There's a bridge down here, we're gonna go check it out. The sign says it's called the Sacred Dancing Cascades and it sounds like there's waterfalls. back. It's our last day at Glacier National Park. We're leaving in the morning. Yep, we're leaving tomorrow morning. I would say that this is probably the most complicated relationship with any of the locations we've been at this whole trip. I would it agree. was both it was both terrifying and gorgeous um, this national park. But everyone's a little hungry. Everyone's a little bit tired. So, we're going to go get some food and call it a day. Left Glacier National Park and are on our way to Great Falls, Montana. Leaving Glacier National Park. just arrived to our KOA in Great Falls and so far it seems like it's going to be really nice. Good morning world. First full day in Great Falls, Montana. We're up. We're raring to go. It's going to be more of a chore day today. I need to do a good chunk of video editing. We've got a big shopping trip to do today and we also got a little surprise in the back of the truck there that we'll show you guys in a little bit. But first some breakfast. This has happened so many times on this trip. Lindsay goes to make some breakfast and we don't have eggs or bacon or bagels. Today it's, it's eggs. We're out of eggs today. So I'm running to the camp store. Success. Very last one. Only six. But I'm pretty sure that's all we need just to get through the day. I'm taking over the video from here and I am heading to the grocery store with my mom and the kids while Mike finishes up some video editing for this week's video. We have a long list of groceries to get because we are out of everything and we're going to be here for two weeks so we definitely have time to use it all up. I think Mike mentioned earlier that we have a surprise that we're looking forward to when we get back but I'm not going to tell you guys what it is just yet. You'll have to wait and see. Well, this is pretty typical for us, <laughs> but I forgot my tea, my mom forgot her mask, and somehow both kids left without their backpacks, despite, I swear, I saw them walk out of the camper with their backpacks on their backs. Thankfully, we are literally less than like 30 seconds away, so no, har no real harm done. <laughs> Okay guys, Walmart trip, take two. Here we go. Well, forgot to film any part of that. So you'll just have to take our word for it that we got groceries or else you can see all of the groceries. 
that are packed in the car because we forgot to take out the cat cages back there. But now we are taking the five second trek back to our campground and we're gonna put groceries away and then we're going to unpack our little surprise. So we're back from groceries. We had some delicious chicken enchiladas for dinner that my mom made. And our surprise is kayaks. <laughs> we bought inflatable kayaks, two double-seated kayaks. And tomorrow we are going to take them on the Missouri River. Dun, da, da, da. Ooh. Explorer K2. Looks like a kayak. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that, you guys! Look. <laughs> We're ready to row. <laughs> 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 